Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. As HTML became more prevalent and the need increased for additional structure for HTML documents, the W3C introduced XML, Extensible Markup Language, a meta markup language used to create other languages and allows developers to define their own tags. XML isn't quite as flexible as HTML, so the W3C rewrote HTML in XML, creating XHTML. XHTML has all the same features of HTML, but with the greater flexibility of XML. The Internet is slowly moving towards XHTML. However, with literally billions of web pages already written, HTML isn't going anywhere soon. Once you've learned HTML, the transition to XHTML is quite easy as it is so similar. The term DHTML stands for Dynamic Hypertext Markup Language. DHTML is an extension of HTML that allows web pages to react to a user's input and enables the inclusion of such things as animations and dynamic menus. DHTML uses a combination of HTML, cascading style sheets, CSS, and JavaScript, some of which we cover in later chapters. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.